Okay guys, so that's why I do this because you know when you pick up clams and pieces and you think hey you know what maybe there's something in there it's it's possible um, and then you bring it back and you and you bust it open and you go holy smokes insane that is loaded to the max with over an inch of crystal inside and you would never think that it would be underneath here unless you decided to bust it up that is crazy <laughs> Well, I just don't know what to say except that, you know, some some clams just have a heart. That's just that's just the way it is. They've got a heart. Hi everyone, Anthony here. Thanks for watching Crystal Miner Rocks. I was out at uh, Fort Drum Crystal Mine, also known as known as Rucks Pit for a couple of days and I brought back a bunch of uh, unbroken clams like this one here. You'll see there's a little bit of crystal showing through that window. And I'm going to give my luck a try breaking them up today. I uh, even got some big pieces here in Matrix. We'll see how those go. Um, so I break away the excess rocks and then I try to split it evenly. And if I'm lucky there's a big section of crystal inside there that will be exposed. Or it'll be nothing or uh, it'll shatter in pieces. So that's part of the fun. So let's see what happens. Hi everyone. Just wanted to show you some of my... Uh, breaking here. Um, I take some of these larger clams that I brought back from Ruck's Pit Port Drum Crystal Mine and I'll trim off, uh, knock these uh, shell rock off until it gets to be about like this. And the ones that I bring back are the ones that kind of present themselves. You'll see some crystal showing through a window like this. Uh, here's another one here. And you just never know how much is underneath that shell. Um, you know, I trimmed this off and uh, I've been busting them up kind of all day today it's been fun um, there's all the little bits and some some split into threes this one did but check out how cool some of these look this is probably my favorite right now because it's a nice heart right there check it out and some of these are just loaded look how that's like almost an inch right there it's loaded with crystal and they just explode sometimes. Check this one out. Wow. Woo! Beautiful honey calcite. There's another small one. Right here. Inside. Bam! Just exploded apart. I'm going to trim these down to where they're, they're kind of fit to each other. Really nice. It's like a little shard right here off the three piece. Sweet. Check out this cool one. There's a lot of growth inside this cavity. It wasn't really in the uh, shell clam, but uh, man, it's some beautiful color there. I just trimmed off the excess from a larger piece. Very nice. Got some visitors during my rock breaking session here. They're just passing through, looking for food as usual. <laughs> Little cuties. Most of these aren't gonna be any good, but you just never know. Um, you probably, well, I'll probably go through, you know, five or six, seven before I get a good one. But this one's got a thin layer. Put them aside. A little bit of dud right there again. Too nice. Let's check this one out. Oh, this, this one exploded. Okay, well, one side's got a, a nice stash of crystal right there. But this one did not break evenly, so I won't have a nice split. 
Oh, I'll show you one that does break uh, easy. When you have a nice split, check it out like this. And this one's a cool one. Um, here's another beautiful heart-shaped one. This one is actually very nice. Check that out. That's almost an inch of crystal there in the height. So I just keep going, clean them up, having a good time. Okay, I got a couple more here. It's a large one. Be nice if this one came out good. Some of these are about medium, big. Look at this one. Oh, that's a that's a nice rainbow inside there. Woo. Look at those big bands right there, those big teeth. Yeah, you just never know. Sweet. Broke the entire shell cap. Uh, this is, uh, I think that's. This one's not going to be a good one. Except the crystal, I think, is down here. This side right here. not going to turn out good. I'm going to keep breaking. Well, starburst. Go back to this guy later. Not much here. That was promising though. Alright, one more. Shell cap. This one exploded. Oh, but I, I got some crystal on this one. Oh, that big pocket right there. Got some, it's a good layer of crystal right there. Okay. The reason I clean it up is because I pick up the small bits sometimes when they're nice, and if I don't have a lot of junk on it, it's much easier to sort it. The crystal from the dirt. Oh, check this out. That's that's why I do it because. Look at the crystal here. That's uh, pretty close to an inch. Huge chunk. Close to a heart too. Alright, you got a good score on this one. I got these two here that actually look kind of cool the way they are with the half deteriorated uh, clam surface and you see it almost like a radiating pattern. So I think I might actually leave these the way they are. 
instead of busting them up. goes for this guy. He's too ready. Oh, this is a three piece. Uh, nice cap radiating piece there, but not a big thick piece. Not a big chunk in this one. Clean that up later. Darn, that was a promising one. You just can't tell. I've hit some that looked like they were garbage and there was like an inch of crystal inside and others the opposite. This one's got a corner chunk there. I keep this, I'm not sure yet. I like to keep them all together, that way I figure them out. Uh, keep them together as a set. That way when I sell them, they have a little bit more meaning. I kept these two aside. These are a little different. Um, they have this cool pattern on the front where they're decaying. So I wonder if I can preserve this because if I hit it in the top, they might just, uh, well, they may shatter any which way, but uh, I might try the underside this time. My goal really is to get an even split so they just can open up like this. First time doing this, upside down. Ooh. Oh, dang. Darn freeway. Okay, well this is a bust. Nothing underneath really. Look cool on the top though. Alright. One more shot. An even split. Uh, thin layer. This is a bust. Small one. Uh, this is the dot too. You gotta go through like five or ten of these before you hit a really good one. That's just the way the numbers go. So that little small one that didn't have much on the edge there, I decided to hit where the crystal growth was coming off. So we got a nice spray right there. Check that out. Nice color on this one too. Bust. Nothing. Oh, just broke the cap off of that. Solid piece of crystal underneath. Call these helmets because when they're solid like that, they do look like a helmet or a turtle growth. 
turtle shell. Kind of cool. It is cool. Let's chisel and see if I get lucky and chisel this little bit, last bit out without breaking it. Nope. Got almost all of it up. Clean this part up, it might shine. This was a piece I just split open. I didn't have it rolling, but what a nice surprise. Look at the starburst underneath there. Dang, the head is some big crystal. I was just actually chipping the uh, rock away, so I just keep this piece right here, but did not know there was this much crystal underneath. And that's the cool, fun surprise of this thing. Look at that. Nice. Here are some of the bigger pieces in Matrix. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna leave that one alone. Got some nice uh, crystal growth on that one. And uh, here you can see some uh, dog tooth here. So this is a nice big piece right there. Uh, some of these other ones I'm gonna bust open. I can see some crystal through the, uh, the window there. But I got some, uh, some nice chunks here that I took away. Still breaking up some of the smaller pieces. It's got a, somebody hit that already. <laughs> got a little spray over there. Look at the depth of color on that calcite. It's just so cool. Huge guy right there. Gonna mess him up. And uh, if I get lucky, I'm just gonna split this guy right off of this piece and just see what happens. Um, go, hope for the best. <laughs> Another one right there, I'm gonna break up later. So let's get this set up. I could always break away the matrix later, but uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah, nice piece, standing piece that there's just crystal on it, too. Oh, it's breaking. All coming apart. Got it. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, this would have been a good one. Oh, crystal in there. Technical difficulties. Look at all the crystal. Woo! Fortunately, I got a lot of shatter lines, so. Let's see what I can make out of this thing. Just continuing the cleanup. Got two more little uh, big ones here. Let's see if I can clean off the uh, overburden piece that I don't want and just keep this. This one I know has some crystal in it. And you see the uh, nice golden calcite right there. So let's see if I can pop this guy off without breaking this guy. get this guy off right here. Oh no, it's breaking. Darn it. And it's coming apart. But not cracked. So, this will be a nice piece by itself. Right, my side. A crystal chunk. And I guess I'll clean this guy up to break since he is now separated from his brother. the bus, nothing in them, except for I me, mean, there is some crystal here, I can see it through the window, so, but it, it looks like it's a really thin layer, doesn't seem to be, nope, that's nothing in it, well, looks like I got just the piece I wanted, right here, cool, now 
mouth with the nice guy. Let's see if I can get this chunk off. Maybe here. And I'll keep the rest. Right. Yes. Yes. Huh. Okay. Looks uh, like you're still on there pretty good. Maybe. <laughs> Looks really porous. Okay, the bottom part, which I don't want, is coming off. Okay. Oh, this is kind of cool. Got a little cave in there. So, here we go. Nice presentable piece with Matrix. So this is what I was left with after busting up all those clams. Um, this box has like breaks into threes and fours and they just exploded but they're just super loaded with crystal as you can see. And uh, got some with doubles right here. They look like uh, hearts when they're put together. Got a whole box here. And these are just some big chunks. Uh, large uh, pieces right there on the black rock. And some medium sized ones right here. Still nice. And I'm gonna take a whole bunch of nice res, high res pictures for you guys so you can check it out. Awesome. Check out this fat boy. This is a really thick, thick clam right here. I mean, we're talking over an inch right here. I don't know if you can tell. And I hit hard. I mean, I pounded on this guy and he just exploded into a head is like almost an inch worth of crystal on the top. It's just huge. Fat boy. So I just finished taking all those pictures uh, for the video and I'm just on a high right now. There are so many awesome pieces. I mean, this is like the first time I've kind of laid them all out after cleaning them and, uh, you know, getting them nice and uh, orderly and, and trimmed out some of the pieces. But uh, they were just, they are some phenomenal finds. Um, I think I had like 25 pieces. Uh, that I kept so you know broke a lot maybe I kept about 30% and uh, it was just so much fun I can't can't believe my luck it's, it's been great thanks for watching Crystal Miner Rocks